Hi, Dr. Kenneth Hughes in Los Angeles. Recently, actually for the past several years, with regard to YouTube, I've tried to place educational videos for patients who observe, you know, the kind of the inner workings of my brain and then sort of the technical prowess generated and uh, during a, any type of surgery that I may be uh, performing. The basic reason for that is I think that people, for the most part, don't trust before and after pictures. I think that they believe that a lot of Photoshop is utilized, and certainly I've seen that. Uh, myself, so I can't discount that. So I've placed a lot of videos on YouTube. Now, these videos have steadily been uh, either age-restricted or, or deleted by YouTube, and it's because people report these things. And I think it's one of those things where, unfortunately, other people who are plastic surgeons don't like seeing some of these complicated procedures performed expertly. And so that's unfortunately what I have to deal with. And so what I've found is that I really cannot, it doesn't make sense to put some of these procedures up anymore because they're, they will all be age restricted and then they get, they get sorted uh, subsequently. And so it actually decreases your rank on YouTube and Google search and everything else. So what I've decided to do is to have more explicative, you know, videos where I'm basically talking about the procedures because then they obviously can't say that there's something has to do with a person's body on there. Even if I block them, you know, I've, I've put on the blur and everything else and they still are saying it's age, age restricted. So I guess I've learned my lesson in the sense that at least for me, I can't post these videos without getting an age restriction. Uh, it seems like other plastic surgeons have no problems with that. But the reason I put them on originally is because I think that the obvious reason for that is you take, you never can discount talent. People can talk about executing something and everything else and sell you on procedures. But at the end of the day, it's up to the patient to evaluate who's really a, has technical mastery of something. And I think the videos help illustrate that. But at least if I explain some of the procedures, some of the considerations to you, I think that you will further appreciate maybe some of the difficult scenarios that I encounter and how I deal with those. Okay, I think that will make patients more comfortable with the procedures and it kind of lets, gives you some insight into who I am just by talking about the procedures, period.